Hey everyone, we're uh, back at it again with another Code Kata uh, with Code Wars. This is um, another uh, level 7 Kata, get the middle character. So uh, we've got a string, and if it's an even number of letters, we want the middle two letters. And if it's uh, odd, just the, the one that's in the uh, exact center. So uh, let's go ahead and get into it. Also I want to note that if it's just one letter we should just return that letter. So uh, getting right into it I think that's probably the easiest way to start. Uh, so I think it, it'd be helpful if we had a length variable to help us out. So um, dot length is a uh, it's a method on string types in JavaScript for those that don't know. So I think that'll be a uh, a nice variable to have. It'll be pretty useful to us in this kata. So I'm going to go ahead and start it off and try and address this case, which is that if it's just uh, one letter, return that letter. So I'm going to say um, if if length is equal to one, then just give us that back right so that's that uh, I'm going to get this in place uh, okay so I'm going to go ahead and run this test and just see what happened um, okay so in these these are our tests down here these first four so if it's just one letter give me that letter back so that's passing that's perfect so uh, going to go ahead and and try and address the uh, other case, which is if it's even, give us the middle two. If it's odd, give us the one that's in the exact center. So um, the way that you do even and odd in JavaScript, at least right now, is uh, with modulus. So I'm going to uh, give the case for odd. So if the remainder of the length divided by two is one, so if there is a remainder, then what I want is the string. I want it split on nothing, right? So just split where each character comes together, which is going to give me an array. And then uh, what I want, I believe, is uh, the length, the, basically the middle of the length, minus one. So uh, accessing the... Uh, position of the array with square brackets there. I've got uh, length divided by 2, so that'll give me the dead center, uh, except for they're 0 indexed, right? So what I really want is um, that minus 1. So I'm uh, going to go ahead and wrap this just to make sure we're good from an order of operations perspective. Close curly bracket. And then um, if not so this is a ternary I didn't actually mention that so uh, if you search ternary operator in JavaScript you're gonna get uh, my favorite documentation which is MDN so conditional operator it's just a shorthand of doing an if else statement so the syntax is we're testing for the true or falseness of this thing if true then give me this if false then give me the other thing so this is saying if it is indeed true that the length is odd, right, then give me this first thing. Then if not, that's the colon. Then give me S split again uh, on each character. And then um, give me the uh, what I want is the um, basically the middle character and then the character right after that. So similar to how we did above, I want a uh, length divided by two minus one. And then um, I want to concatenate the same exact thing, right? So I'm actually just going to copy. Same exact thing except one place up. So give me that. And that's it. So let's go ahead and run this and see what happens. I find that one of the uh, the best ways of figuring these things out is just running and seeing where you get your failing tests. So running that, 
and you can see we have a lot passing but not all um, so I'm getting undefined uh, so I'm gonna stop right here and just say another good way of figuring it out which is the way I usually prefer is using code pen because code pen allows you to just spin something up really quickly and you can also at that point console log console log is kind of hard uh, in the context of code wars so if that's your style I um, I would encourage you to look into that. So what's happening here is that um, on a lot of just single characters we're getting undefined. And so looking back at the code, um, thinking about why that is, uh, the reason is that you know if it's an odd number and we're dividing by two, let's say uh, five, right? So five divided by two, uh, 2.5 and then minus 1 is 1.5 so I'm trying to get the index at 1.5 which of course uh, isn't going to work which is why we're getting undefined and all of these single character tests are failing so uh, the um, math object in JavaScript has a, a way of rounding up which is called dot seal uh, aka sealing so rounding up uh, so you just wrap it in this uh, math.seal and so I'm going to go ahead and do that parenthesis here and then parenthesis at the end and go ahead and run that and it does indeed pass now this is just uh, the first way I thought to solve it today so uh, as I've said in previous videos the real value in code wars is getting to see how other people have solved uh, the different kata so I'm going to go ahead and submit so I can see how other people have done it uh, I'm guessing there's a more elegant solution, so uh, looking forward to seeing what other people have come up with. And here we go. Internet's a little bit slow, but that's okay. Perhaps getting some errors. Here we go. And look, a one-liner, just as I thought. So this is uh, returning a substring of the string that's a great method I didn't think to use dot substring and um, middle length s divided by 2 so um, this one is similar to what we did uh, so as I said these are really good ways to learn and uh, we're going to encourage you when you solve a kata to look at the way the other people did it so thanks so much and I'll see you in the next one